Hello, Yarnabees. It's Sandy. I'm having a bit of a morning. Uh, okay, today is day five of Vlogist on the Cheap. There we go. <laughs> I, yeah, I, I'm, I don't know if I'm tired or stressed or I, I, I don't know. <laughs> Anyways, um, for those of you that are new, that don't know what's going on, you know, I said I wasn't going to say this every time, but I seem to be saying this every time. So, um, Sandy Duda from Left is Right Crochet and I are doing a gift exchange for Vlogist called Vlogist on the Cheap. And the cheap means that we got everything from the dollar store. So it's kind of, it's just fun. You know, it's like something new. Sandy came up with it and I went, yes. <laughs> so here we are. <laughs> okay. Um, do you want to just get into it? Okay, let's get into it. Here we go. Just go and pick one out and this one. Ta da! Okay. Hmm. It's kind of heavy, kind of bookish. Hmm. Crinkling. Let's see if I can do this without spilling my coffee came in here and I sat down and spilled my coffee all over my table here and it's just yeah so here we go aha it is oh this is cute look at that I'm constantly I have a notebook beside me on my chair when I'm crocheting so I can take little notes and stuff and I'm constantly misplacing it you misplace it it's sitting right beside you my glasses are always gone my pens are always gone like I just oh but this one has the pen attached to it how good is that this is awesome look at that little notebook look at that and the pen's right there oh that's gonna be great thank you oh that's awesome because I always like if I'm watching people's videos and stuff, I like to jot little things down and, you know, say, you know, so when I talk about my, on my vlog, I can say, oh yeah, and so-and-so did this and I thought that and, you know, whatever, right? But I never find my notebook and then I go to do my vlog and I'm like, <whistles> can't figure out what I'm supposed to say. So, yeah. So this is going to help and this is going to hopefully stay put. So, um, yeah, I don't know. It's like, it's weird. It's like our glasses and everything. They all have legs. I have probably about 10 pairs of glasses. Can never find a one. Ow! <laughs> Jeez, really? Uh, ow! Okay, that hurt. <laughs> get your teeth out of the way sandy oh my god oh it's got to be this heat i am absolutely i've come to the conclusion that i am going through my menopause again or something because i am drenched all the time and it's not just the heat um because even when it's cool i am just like you know like just absolute I can feel it coming and then it just, it's like a hot flash times a hundred. It doesn't stop. It's like with a hot flash, you get your hot flash and after like a minute it goes away and then you're all good, right? This one goes and doesn't go away. And so, oh yeah, it's like, I'm just constantly, I, I need to have showers and I'm, constantly changing and it's it's ridiculous so are any of you having that same thing because I went I was going through menopause and I it was gone it was over finished I'm post-menopausal right but now I'm getting these wicked hot flashes and I'm just like this is crazy so yeah anyway enough about me um if you go 
well, if you go, you're going to go over to Sandy's at Leftist Right Crochets um, and watch her video. Uh, and she mentions that last week she um, had to send her puppy Giacomo over the Rainbow Bridge. Um, I can't talk a lot about this because I'll, I'll just start bawling my eyes out. <clears throat> so, as you guys know, we lost our puppy Odie uh, last year and it was devastating. And, you know, it's, um, it's a hard thing to, to deal with, you know, um, it's, it's really weird actually, you know, it's like when you lose a person, you know, it's devastating and you, you go through your grieving process and you know, all of that. And then when you lose a, a pet, a beloved pet that is like a family member, you go through this whole different kind of grieving. And um, it's, it's hard. It's really hard. So, um, you know, I love you, Sandy. You know, I was, I tried to be there with you as much as I could throughout the whole process, checking up on you all the time and um, being there for you if you needed to talk. So, um, I'm still always here for you. You know that. And I love you so, so, so much. Um, and you know, it being a year down the road, it's, it's better, but it still gets me. And the worst part of it is when Facebook does these memories and all these memories are coming up with Odie's picture and stuff. Holy man. Devastation all over again. It's crazy. So, <clears throat> yeah, I just, mm, I, I love you so much. I really do. And I'm so sorry that happened. I know it's the circle of life and, and whatnot, but it's still hard. It really is. So, anyway. Okay, so go over there and give Sandy some yarny love and, uh, you know, give her a little extra. Okay. Okay, guys, I love you so much. And I guess I will talk to you tomorrow. Tomorrow, day six. <laughs> I, you know, I'm getting to the point where I'm, I may have to stop saying what day it is because I'm going to forget. <laughs> it's like stupid menopause. Anyways, okay, I love you guys. I'll see you tomorrow. Bye. Hello, Yarnabees. How are you today? Today is day five. <laughs> Holy cow, we just started this and I'm already not even knowing what day it is. Of, uh, nope, not season's new beginnings. That was last year. <laughs> oh man. Okay, you know what? Hang on. I, I think I need. I need some of this. <sighs> mm. uh, okay, it is day five of, oh my God. <laughs>